Hey everybody, check it out. Here we have the HTRC C150 charger. It looks just like this baby here. Pretty cool. It's an AC-DC professional balance charger and discharger. Does storage, yada yada. US plug. Here's some of the specs there of the C150. You can do a, up to a six, one to six cell lipo. NICAD nickel metals up to 15 cells. Smart batteries, input power, uh, DC 11 to 18 volt. There you go. A bit of display here. So let's take it out of the back box, show you what you get. Oh, sweet. Got a lipo bag, that's a bonus. Here we have the black one. That's shown by the black dot here. Here we have some an adapter, like a, a friend of mine calls it a squid. But uh, you've got lots of options for what you can charge there. Here's where you you'll plug your balance port into. And down in here we have a couple more things here. Here we have this is the battery checker that you can plug into the balance tab of your lipo. Here's the 120 plug-in for that. And underneath there we have the manual. There's the manual. So there's what's in that package. Um, I suppose the next thing to do here was we'll pl or we'll hook that into some power and we'll hook a battery up and we'll show you how it works. Stay tuned. Okay, we've got a plugger, got her plugged into some 120. Turn it on here. Loads up that quick. Let me get this battery plugged in and we'll be right back. Okay, we're gonna charge the 6S Infan 4200. So obviously we're gonna select lithium battery. Let me get this to focus to show a little better for you guys. But anyways, you, there's a lot of options in here. You can click through your different kinds. You can save them to memory. Anyways, we're going to do a lithium, so enter. And you can see it says balance. Well, you can do charge. You can do fast charge. You can do storage. You can discharge. Balance charge, lipo charge. Do balance charge, lipo. Here you can choose your different kinds. This is a LiPo, this is a 6S, I don't know how it knew that already. Pretty amazing, so since it's a 42, I always charge a 1C or less, so I'm pretty conservative, I like my batteries to last. We're gonna do this, hold down the start button, there it goes, checking the battery. It wants you to confirm that you have a 6S pack. Yes, I do have a 6S pack. Boom, here we go, okay. When we come back, it'll be done, and I'll show you what it shows. One thing, though, is as you scroll through here, it'll show you what each of the cells are. But anyways, we'll be right back with the aftercharge. Okay, here we go. It finished. It says full. Come on, focus, focus, focus here. It tells you the voltage, how long it took, how much it put in there. Here's the ending balance of each cell. And there you go. That's how it works. Pretty awesome machine. I like it. Gets a thumbs up from me. Like, comment, subscribe. Check the description down below for links to everything I use. And let me know what you think down below in the comments. Okay, so here's that bag opened up. This would be a good bag to put your battery in when you charge it. It's got a little velcro flap here. Kind of hard to do one handed. Just put your battery in there pretty good size you can see it next to my 6s this um, little beeper battery checker deal you have to kind of plug it in the opposite way of like your other checkers as you can see it's labeled here where the negative is the top one usually with the little ridges on it that's the top one so it's backwards but anyways it's reading off the cell count here total voltage and then it goes each cell one at a time 
they vary a lot more here than they did on the charger so I'd have to compare the two Cool. And on the back is kind of some instructions. If I get her to focus here, it tells you what to do. So yeah, neat little tool. There you go.